in the improved route, the transmission line would cross from Canada into New Hampshire in Pittsburgh and extend approximately 192 miles to Deerfield in New Hampshire. In total, more than 80% of the entire line would be built on existing transmission line corridors or underground along public roadways. The remaining portion would be constructed on land the project is leased. On the overhead portions of the route, we have modified our design so that structure heights and corridor width are reduced where practical to avoid potential visual impacts. Northern Pass will begin in Coaz County with a high voltage direct current or DC line that will run along a new right of way through the towns of Pittsburgh, Clarksville, Stewartstown, Dixville, Millsfield, and Dummer. Two sections of this segment, totaling nearly eight miles, will be underground along public roadways, and more than 24 miles will be located on working forest land that is already subject to routine timber harvesting. Each underground section will include two transition stations, which are stations where the line transitions from overhead to underground at one station, and back to overhead at the next station, for a total of four. One in Pittsburgh, two in Clarksville, and one in Stewartstown. From the end of the new right-of-way in Dummer, the line will continue through Stark, Northumberland, Lancaster, Whitefield, to Dalton, along an existing right-of-way where transmission lines stand today. The line will enter Grafton County in the town of Bethlehem, transition underground and proceed through Sugar Hill, Franconia, Easton, Woodstock, Thornton, Campton, and Plymouth transitioning back to overhead in Bridgewater and continuing through Ashland along an existing right-of-way where transmission lines stand today. 52 miles of the route within Grafton County is entirely underground through the areas in and around the White Mountain National Forest, the Appalachian Trail, and the Franconia Notch area. This requires one transition station in Bethlehem and another in Bridgewater, where the line returns overhead and rejoins an existing transmission corridor. The line is located in only one town in Belknap County, the town of New Hampton. The line then re-enters Grafton County in Bridgewater and continues through Bristol before entering Merrimack County in the town of Hill. It then proceeds to Franklin, where the line will enter a proposed new converter station. From there, the line will switch to alternating current, or AC, and will travel through the towns of Northfield, Canterbury, Concord, Pembroke, and Allenstown. Finally, the line would enter the Rockingham County town of Deerfield, where it would connect with the New England power grid at the substation on Kate Road.